Hi chaps, just got a little something for you guys to try if you've got the Oculus Quest 2 um, you will have seen these probably before first thing to definitely do if you've got a weaker to a medium sort of graphics card come into the Asynchronous Space Warp if that's how you pronounce it Force 45 got to have the Oculus Debug tool running to obviously do on this that's the only setting you need to change then go into the Oculus software, click on Devices, click your headset, scroll down to Graphics Preferences and make sure you set that to 90. And what that will do is when you're in IL2 it should peg to 45 and your graphics card should be able to get around that when you're flying so it should stop most of the blips. If you don't have this on what happens is that it tries to run at 90 and it will keep dropping to 45 because ASW is set to auto on the actual headsets and by doing that you get major blips so force 45 make sure that's di disabled you might get a little bit of ghosting but you should get a smoother fly if you've got a powerful graphics card make sure you disable this don't leave it at 90 though because the chance of you getting 90 frames per second even 3080s, 3090s some of them even struggle to get 90 so what I recommend is setting it to 72 and for some reason I mean I can sit around about the 70 mark and I definitely get a much smoother ride I've tried the 90 and the 45 but I do notice quite a bit more ghost in it it might be because I can constantly hit the, the 45 pretty much so I get quite a bit of ghosting whereas um, if I set it to the 72 dis disable it pretty much all the ghosting goes and um, I get very little blips definitely seems like a smooth ride so either way lower or medium sort of graphics card force 45 90 hertz if you've got a high end disable that set to 72 give it a go guys let me know how you get on